Hello and thank you everyone for joining me, Douglas Blakey, the editor of Retail Banker International and the group editor at Global Data for Banking to join me for what is the 12th annual Retail Banker International Asia Trailblazer Awards. Thank you for being here and what has become an important event for retail banking in the region. First of all, I want to acknowledge thanks to all of the banks for taking part in the awards this year at a time when business remains very far from normal. The awards are now in their 12th year and despite the challenge of COVID, working from home, over-reliance on Zoom and everything else, it's hugely encouraging to observe not just the sheer quantity of
turn to the institutional awards, including some outstanding examples of how optimising customer centricity is leading through to improve net promoter scores and ultimately the winning bank's bottom line, as well as examples of how carefully crafting segmentation strategies allied with shrewd IT investment is paying off and boosting the winning bank's market share.
is turning to the Asia Trailblazer Awards. Two big categories, Asia Trailblazer of the Year 2021 for individuals and secondly, the Asia Trailblazer of the Year 2021 for institutions. As in past years, very, very hotly contested and in these categories, very difficult to determine a winner, but ultimately, in both cases, very deserved winners to celebrate.